if you hear doggos barking in the background, don't mind that. That's called having doggos, okay? Doggos for life. Doggos, doggos, doggo. There's a fly on my... Ew, get away, get away, get away. Okay. Hey guys, it's Wolfstar. Welcome back to another video. And a compliment I get a lot is how soft my Webkin's fur seems to be. So I decided to make a video on that and kind of talk to you guys about how to keep your Webkin's fur nice. And there's one thing I'd like to say is there isn't a correct way to maintain and keep a Webkin's fur nice forever. That's physically not possible, especially if you play with your Webkin's or film regularly. So these tips are kind of just to help you prevent it from happening faster, but it's not gonna last forever. It's just going to help in the long run. But eventually your Webkin's fur will get not as soft and shiny fresh as it was before. I have a few tips that I use that hopefully will come in handy for you. And I feel like at least one of these will help you keep your Webkin's fur nice. Or this is just irrelevant, who knows? Probably irrelevant, you know, because that's what my channel is nowadays. My first tip is to not snuggle your Webkin's a ton. And now I know that some people love to snuggle their Webkin's, and sleep with their Webkin's and stuff, and I used to be like that. When I realized it was really damaging them, when I realized it was really damaging them, I stopped snuggling a bunch of different ones and I kind of took like a few, like maybe like five that I would snuggle instead of the other ones. The other ones would stay nice. Maybe ones that are less important, maybe stringy webkins, those take longer to wear down. Maybe ones with really short fur, maybe obviously not rare ones like a timber wolf. Um, and that is something that has helped me back in the day, but I did not snuggle my webkins. I just ripped my paper in half on accident. I'm not in the right mind the next tip i have is do not bring them outside a lot and this seems like kind of slightly obvious they'll get dirty if they're outside a lot and obviously i film but i film in an area where there's not a lot of dirt it's mostly just like leaves and clovers and stuff like that um but do not bring them a lot and throw them around like i used to do that and it was not smart also a sort of obvious one is to brush them often and some brushes that i recommend are thin wire combs, flea combs, or just regular combs. I recommend combs, especially really thin combs because they get through the Webkin's hair nicely um, and just, I recommend them. Also make sure to be very gentle with your Webkin's because if you're really rough with them, throwing them around, scratching them, letting kids play with them and stuff, they will get damaged and that is not good for them. You just want to be very gentle with them like they were real. Obviously they are stuffed animals, but if you want to keep the fur nice, be gentle, treat them like... Not like you're a three-year-old bringing around their bunny stuffed animal to every store and stuff. Was that a, that was a horrible example, but just be, don't be really rough, just be gentle with them, and I'm sure they'd appreciate that too. <laughs> this next tip is not possible for everybody because it is kind of just not something that everybody can have, especially if it's a rare Webkins, but have duplicates. Um, This is kind of a, a weird one and kind of a little bit confusing to explain, but if you um, have duplicates, Duplicates, the Webkins will not get as damaged because you will be using both of the Webkins and it will just take longer to wear down because you have two of the same one. Does that make any sense at all? It, why, why did I include this in the video? Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video and I'm sorry for being really inactive. I'm trying to be more active. I'm gathering a bunch of video ideas and hoping to bring this channel back to life. So I hope you enjoyed this and if these tips helped you please give the video a thumbs up because i would really appreciate that and that would be a nice very nice gesture for you to do especially because i'm irrelevant yay okay i'll see you guys in the next video bye